Hi, Tour Tour. <clears throat> Welcome back, guys. I hope you all are doing well today. This is going to be for anybody with Taurus placements in their charts. Make sure you all flip and you switch the roles. Take what resonates. Leave what doesn't fit for your situation, guys. Thank you guys so much for your love, your support, your donations, and your super chat. Super thanks. The love never goes unnoticed. And I am returning that back to you all tenfold. Okay? Anything you guys uh, need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box. And please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other um, social media platforms. Okay, Taurus? So let's see, Taurus, Taurus. What's going on with my babies? Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses, please return any spell work, any dark magic, <laughs> that is sense of harm, Taurus, and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones, turn it back to the center, block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Taurus, Taurus, and protect me as I channel the messages for Taurus. <laughs> Y'all could be dealing with a cancer. I'm thinking about cancer's reading. <laughs> that reading was, was funny. Again, cancer's reading always funny, bro, but you can have cancer placements. Child, you go look at the title, you're gonna bust out laughing. Or you gotta watch the reading to get it. But anyways, let's see. What's going on for Taurus here? Temperance at the bottom of the deck. So yeah, temperance in the eight of wands and the six of wands. So good energy. Peace, harmony, and happiness is coming into your life, Taurus. I feel like um this is you receiving the rewards and recognition you um deserve. Okay. Something is balancing out for you here in divine timing. Or you just have protection as you're moving forward as well, Taurus. You could have good energy being sent to something that you're doing here. Do you have a lot of people that support something that you're doing? You could have good energy coming your way when it comes down to um, you being seen in a public eye or something like that. Okay. Mm. Knight of Swords reverse, Page of Wands, Knight of Wands reverse. Somebody here's a, a loser. They're attacking you. <clears throat> Whoever this is is jealous, competing. <laughs> okay, Knight of Swords Reverse is a coward. Somebody's a coward here. They're a follower. Okay, whatever. Anyways, let's see. What's going on for Swords Wars? Three of Swords. Hmm. Libra Saturn. So heartbreak, pain, sadness here, grief. You could be grieving something, Swords. I really don't feel like that. See, yeah, look at your ass. The Empress and Two of Cups and the Hierophant. You ain't grieving a fucking thing. Okay, so let's see who this is. Let's get into their business since they want to come up in your reading. What the fuck? What's, what else? And what's this here? Could be a Libra here. Libra Saturn could be significant. Okay, seven of pentacles in the reverse. So something here, there's no growth. Um, or something is Taurus. I mean somebody could be on life support. My condolences. This is you going through a death. Okay, or um somebody something is not able to be taken care of anymore or nurtured. This could end in, in something horrible. Okay, um Taurus Saturn here with the seven of pentacles reverse. I feel like somebody made a bad investment. Somebody here made some sort of really bad investment. Okay, somebody could be losing a lot of money. This could be a lot of frustration, things uh, being postponed, or this is setbacks here. Setbacks, delays. What's, what else for Taurus? Somebody here invested a lot of money into love magic. They did a lot of love spells on you, like a lot. <laughs> okay. The High Priestess Reverse, Pisces, mm. so this is like unwanted attention with the High Priestess in the Reverse, um, somebody's intuition could also be being blocked here, this could be somebody doubting their intuition, but I'm just getting this, this mainly for me right now is what I'm feeling is unwanted attention. Somebody is, this could be like somebody having outbursts too, or somebody's like really upset. What else? Seven of Wands reverse. Leo Mars. Mm, yeah, somebody's like weak. Somebody, for some of you, somebody could be sick here. 
Somebody could be sick. This could be a high priestess. A dark one, though, in the reverse. This could be a dark high priestess. That's, I, for some of you, they're experiencing a backfire from some magic that they were doing. Uh, mm -hmm. Seven of Wands reverse, though, is someone that's feeling weak or tired or... Um, surrendering that's what i'm honestly getting somebody like on a hospital bed they're like letting go now because somebody has been trying to stay alive for too long they gotta somebody's like gonna be passing away or something child mm. i don't know what, what else here when somebody did this shit though they wasn't thinking about their family that's what I'm saying. Y'all bitches do shit. You don't think about anybody else around you. You just do shit because you and your ego and you're delusional from all this black ass magic y'all doing to yourself because you're not hurting the person that you think you're hurting. Like, what the fuck? That's what I'm saying. Like, what is somebody supposed to do about this energy? What are we supposed to feel like? After you've been attacking us, what the fuck are we supposed to feel like? Yeah, two of cups reverse. So a breakup here there will be no reconciliation i feel like you and somebody are not on the same page y'all don't see eye to eye here I, like i said i feel like somebody's been doing a lot of magic to get you and somebody to come back together now they losing you uh, they losing you for sure they lost you for good now they ain't no fucking reconciliation you don't trust this person this person could have been abusive too but this two of cups in the reverse <clears throat> somebody here just fails to compromise with you they fail to kind of like you know just release and let the shit go. They want to keep on trying to like fight and do something here. After you just fucking surrender the situation, they want to keep on going with some shit. Definitely Cancer Venus here. Maybe go watch Cancer. <laughs> I don't know, but um, somebody here could have made a bad investment to yeah, Eight of Swords to bind somebody. Or to cause a separation between you and somebody you actually do want to be with. But let's see. The moon reverse. Damn, that could be good. Oh, excuse me. Damn, what the fuck? I'm burping. My stomach doing stuff, Taurus. <laughs> so anyways, um, this the high priestess reverse and the moon reverse. <laughs> Cancer, Pisces energy. It could be a big ass secret coming out, like huge, about somebody. Yeah, somebody here is finding out that they made a bad investment into a false person, a high priestess reverse, a dark witch, or something like that. Something coming out about this person. And they they breaking up or something. Or this is you. Yeah, the Hierophant and the Chariot. Mm -hmm. So your counterpart could be, your false counterpart, right? It could be losing their damn mind, I guess, Taurus. Or this is your person that, that this was a third party situation. Your person is finally realizing that somebody around him is a false high priestess. But what's the Three of Swords? The Fool, Aquarius energy. What's Three of Swords with the Fool? Nine of Swords reverse, yeah. So somebody's coming out of their head. There's no more anxiety or overthinking about something. I feel like somebody's really coming out of their head. Somebody's moving forward and letting go. Going into a new beginning here. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune upright. Somebody's seeing that there's a light at the end of at the end of the tunnel. Okay, and whatever somebody conjured up here, their ass is, is going to reverse. Somebody else is probably being haunted and some more shit. Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles reverse, Justice reverse. Yeah, whoever did, whoever them, them fucking did this magic here, they ass is getting ready to get, get fucked up. They are. What's the Nine of Swords reverse? It's these people, boy, I'm telling you. Yeah, the King of Wands reverse. Wow. Mm. Leo energy. What's the Nine of Swords reverse, King of Wands reverse? Uh, yeah, the Moon came out reversed again. The strength card upright in the tower. Yeah, somebody here is really shocked by the fact that you overcame some shit, bruh. You strong as hell, Taurus. <laughs> somebody like, what the fuck? How did they survive that, bitch? You just shouldn't have attacked this person in the first place, dumbass. 
So I feel like this King of Wands reverse is being haunted by some shit. Cause what's being revealed is the fact that you're moving on. Like you're 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 kind of like you've overcame something. The shrimp card, the tower. Okay, like this is causing some sort of tower moment. This is also talking about a revelation here. <clears throat> yeah, the shrimp card is having the confidence to overcome something. Um, feeling self-assured, pushing through challenges and obstacles. And somebody is moving away from fear and anxiety and stress. Yeah, somebody is finally somebody is finally able to move away from a dark high priestess in the reverse. But I feel like this king of wands in the reverse could have hired people to do magic for someone, for a divine masculine to not be able to move on from a high priestess reverse. And them not being able to move on from a high priestess reverse means that you and this person, yeah, ten of swords reverse, a hex has been broken means that you and that person won't be able to be together. And that's what they wanted to happen for some of you, is what I'm getting. Um, <clears throat> yeah, what's this King of Wands reverse spirit? Give me more on the King of Wands reverse. Who are they? This could be like a bitter ass ex, somebody here that's competing with you or your person. Okay, yeah, the Two of Pentacles. Hmm. Yeah, because this person was able to um, obtain blessings through you or your person. Them being connected to either one of you would bring in blessings for them. And they ain't supposed to be getting a fucking thing. That's why they ass getting called out right now. In this reading and in real life. The tower. So yeah, there, there's a revelation here. Mm -hmm. Whoever this is too, they they just don't plan for rainy days. This person is lazy as fuck. They don't want to do shit. Their sacral chakra energy is blocked. Like everything is blocked for this person. They can't even do anything. This is a false leader. Somebody that wants to be a leader so bad, but they're not. They're false and they're a fucking loser. They are. Hmm. <clears throat> so this could be them that's heartbroken or... I don't know. Somebody around them could be getting ready to feel this, feel some sort of pain because of their own, because of this stupid person's actions. Like people don't think about the shit that they do that can harm somebody else. But what's the Seven of Pentacles reversed? Some sort of energy between you and your spirit team, or you and a particular person is balanced out now. What's the Seven of Pentacles here reverse? The death card, yeah, Scorpio here. What's seven of pentacles reverse to the death card? The world reverse. Mm. So something here failed. Somebody here is they 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 didn't achieve a goal. Um, <clears throat> their life is getting ready to be very 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 disorganized. There will be no tranquility, no solitude, no peace, <laughs> no rest for the wicked. Okay, basically. Let me write something down before I forget. All right, I'm sorry. So the world reverse is like having to cut your losses. Okay, what's the death card? The Queen of Pentacles reverse, child. I'm telling you, for some of you, it's a mother figure that's going through a backfire, that things are ending in this person's life or they're passing away. Is somebody's mother but they're a dark witch though this person for some of you this person could be passing away or they sick or something like that somebody here could be um this person's uh if they had if, they, if this person is a witch here they were siphoning energy of other probably kids and other younger people here to stay looking young i feel like somebody could be either losing hella weight or they're gaining a lot of weight okay or something like that but this person is very hateful too. This is a nasty energy. Somebody here is a bad mother figure. They're, they're a horrible mother. They're a horrible parent anyway. I feel like, you know. But I just feel like uh, 
they're going through a lot of endings. This could just be simply an ending with somebody's finances. I mean, this could be you, Taurus, that's going through some sort of change or transition with your finances. So you could feel kind of like ungrounded or you don't feel too secure with your money right now. But I mean, I don't really feel like that's you. Could be a Capricorn or something. What's the um, death card with the Queen of Pentacles reverse? The Four of Pentacles. <clears throat> so yeah, somebody is trying to hold on for dear life to some money or some finances, or somebody's trying to hold on to somebody for dear life. Um, somebody going through a backfire with their money, their finances getting ready to be looking real crazy. They're experiencing a lot of endings in their life right now. Whoever this is, are they getting ready to for doing this fucking magic? <laughs> for doing this magic, I mean, I don't know what else to say. What's the world reverse? I feel like four of pentacles could be you probably protecting yourself. Somebody here was hiding something or... Uh, what, what's the four of pentacles real quick? Let me see. Definitely strong Capricorn. The star reverse. What's four of pentacles reverse with the star reverse? For some of you, somebody's losing their job. Yeah, the high priestess reverse. This fake ass high priestess in the reverse. They could be a spiritualist, but they're just dark. They're experiencing an ending and shit like that with their finances. They losing shit. Because this person could have been trying to attack you as an actual high priestess for some of you. They could have wanted some sort of stardom, fame, recognition or something like that. But I feel like this person, now they in despair. Because they ain't getting that. Seven of Pentacles, somebody, this person made a bad investment. And I'm looking at that King of Wands over there. <laughs> they could have been the ones that started the shit. What the fuck is the Four of Pentacles, the Star Reverse? Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. For some of you guys, you could be needing to get ready to start on a project. You need to jump in at something because you could be getting ready to see a change with your money as well. Um, if you don't do whatever Spirit's telling your ass to do, you're moving out of your North Node. I mean, you're moving out of your South Node and going towards your North Node here. So there could be a need for you to work on something new. And you could be experiencing a setback or delay with your finances because it's time for you to work on something else that Spirit wants you to work on. It's time to go to, to the next phase of your journey. <clears throat> but I'm getting, though, if that's not the case. Um, the star reverse is lacking faith, boredom, and lacking inspiration. I feel like whatever this is somebody is doing to it, they're not meant to do it. That's not their passion. That's not something that they're passionate about. They're not meant to be in that kind of position. Maybe they were trying to swap places with you or they wanted to be seen in the position that you were being seen in. But I just feel like that ain't, that ain't their place. Somebody here, yeah, somebody wanted fame, recognition, stardom, success. And I just feel like it's a no. Somebody's a social climber. Queen of Pentacles reverse. So this social climber bitch is getting ready to be coming to an end. Because I feel like whoever they're using to try to attack you here is they, they getting ready to lose their job or lose their damn life for some of you. Like, they do too much. Somebody did way too much. And then the person that sit up here and try to start all this shit, they running. And like, they keep trying. I feel like I keep getting this person that's trying to run. What's the world reverse? Yeah, somebody's a follower. Somebody was a follower and decided to attack somebody or bring a lot of unwanted attention to somebody, a lot of nasty attention, a lot of dark shit to someone, dark magic, or whatever they say. Somebody tried to take somebody out spiritually with magic. Yeah, that's what they tried to do. Like, somebody tried to block someone from um, seeing certain things, doing certain things, being able to level up here with magic. This is a criminal. This is a criminal act spiritually. So they going to what? Criminal jail? I mean, spiritual jail? They going to fucking spiritual jail. What's the word reverse? <laughs> Good luck. What the fuck? The the Knight of Wands here. What's the world reverse with the Knight of Wands? And the Three of Cups. Yeah, so this is you being confident, happy, joyful, taking action here, going after whatever it is that you're passionate about. This could be somebody here coming in to reconcile with you. Yeah, Page of Wands with the Six of Wands. Or this could be you. Just doing whatever the fuck you want to do. You're going um, after whatever it is that you desire. This is you feeling inspired to move forward. Um, you could be meeting new people, making new friends, but you're being celebrated right now. Somebody's coming towards you to reconcile. Yeah, like somebody tried to stop something by making somebody be in and out, back and forth in your energy. 
But this is somebody that you're actually supposed to be working with for some of you. You could be definitely getting ready to take off with something here as far as your work goes as well. Yeah, you have a new exciting project here that you could be getting ready to start that's going to bring a lot of recognition and rewards to you as well. So now, now, Ten of Swords reverse, Ace of Cups reverse, Seven of Swords reverse. There's a cancel celebration or something that's being canceled. I feel like somebody wants to wants to run away because they know that they don't fuck with you for real. Somebody's a two faced losing bitch that keep trying to run away. I'm so sick of seeing this cowardly ass. I feel like this is a man trying to use other bitches to cloak themselves in their energy, bitch. We know it's you with your pussy ass. Somebody's a fucking hoe. And they keep on trying to run away or run away from their consequences. Now that some shit is over, party's over. Now this bitch want to run away because they don't want to be confronted for all the evil shit that they did behind the scenes to you, behind your back. The fuck? Somebody here is a lame ass whore. And they trying to like, they know the worst is yet to come for their ass. So they keep on trying to duck and dodge karma. Bitch, no. You won't get this fucking work. What's this high priestess reverse? What's the high priestess reverse? They're going to throw other people in the mix. They don't give a fuck about nobody. But this person is a criminal in the spirit. This is this person probably has taken out a lot of other people spiritually. You know what I mean? Like, spiritually. Like, you don't know what somebody here, what problem somebody got. Like, if somebody here is trying to um, hurt somebody spiritually, they could become suicidal. They could become mental. They could become, you know what I'm saying? It's like people die a lot from spiritual attacks that they don't even know about. The people in the, the, the autopsy can't even trace spiritual attacks. They will, they will, you know, check it off as something that's natural that happened to somebody. But this is the kind of shit that go on here. And if you wasn't spiritually strong, your ass would have been taken out too from this. And nobody would know why the fuck you died. Losing ass bitch. What's the high priestess reverse? Somebody's a fucking clown. I can't stand this bitch. This person that keep on coming up, trying to hide what they distorted ass. What's the high priestess reverse? But yeah, look at this losing ass bitch here. Don't want to be confrontational. They don't want to be confrontational here. Knight of Cups reverse this obsessed ass, losing ass, troublemaking ass bitch here. I'm sick of they ass. Somebody could be, this could be a karmic masculine and at the age of, they could be between 25 and 35 years old. But you're grown old ass. You older now, bitch. Why the fuck you doing all that? But they, this person is obsessed. They're really obsessive. And I feel like they ass is sleeping with a bunch of dark witches that they use to attack you. That they know aren't even spiritually um, that more powerful than you. What the fuck is this high priestess reverse with the knight of cups reverse? So this could be a high priestess in a family that's getting ready to pass away or they're getting ready to lose a whole bunch of shit. Death is surrounding these people. Just period. Yeah, the emperor reverse. That, that's what I'm saying. This emperor in the fucking reverse has gotten people here. The high priestess reverse five of swords has grown a lot of, a lot of nasty attention your way from a bunch of dark witches that were harassing you, bullying you and shit like that. That's 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 what I'm saying. Like the chariot reversing the in the the devil. So coercion or somebody being forceful, really aggressive. I don't know. But the emperor in the reverse is someone that tried to abuse their power and position of authority. This person here, whoever this is, they sleep around a lot too. They fuck off, they sleep around a lot, they deal with a bunch of hoes. <clears throat> There's definitely a warlock here. There's on some fuck shit here. This could, for some of you, this is your own damn baby daddy with a warlock ass and think that they that they doing something that you don't know that they're a warlock here. And you gotta play nice with this bitch to keep the peace. That's why they keep on trying to run away and shit like that. Because I feel like honestly, you know what they're doing and it's not bothering you because you just know, you know shit. So if you have to be around this person, it's like, oh, okay, you're a losing asshole and I ain't gotta pay you no mind. It's just it is what it is. You wanna get your karma. So I'm not really worried. I feel like that's the attitude you're carrying, and that's gonna carry you far, Taurus. Because what the fuck you gonna sit up here? What I know that you attack me with other bitches, so they can be like, "Oh, what are you talking about? You're crazy. You're delusional." No, <laughs> you just gonna let shit ride. How it's gonna ride? Because this is the kind of bit a spiritual narcissist. You can't fucking do anything on a 3D with them, really. You can't do anything. So it's just like you gotta let spirit. You gotta trust that spirit is gonna handle this, and they handling it all right. Somebody being handled all right. 24-24 on the timer with a weak ass. What's this in for reverse? Somebody feel like they control some shit or they a damn sugar daddy or a pimp or something like that. Pimping these weak ass hoes to, to attack you. What's the in for reverse? Like, what the fuck? This person has lost their mind. Nine of cups. Yeah, whoever this is, they want fame, recognition, stardom. Like, with they stupid ass. Nine of cups too. Somebody here that's sexual or all they think about is pleasuring themselves. 
but they definitely want status and fame. I just heard, um, cause I was looking at this world in this man's hand. I got the whole world in my hands. I got the whole world. Somebody here think they powerful with a weak, sorry, pathetic ass. This person here uses their wisdom for the wrong reasons. This is a very, very dark spiritualist, a dark priest, or whoever this person think that they are. What the fuck is, what else is this emperor reverse here with the nine of cups? Somebody could have, this person could have somebody pregnant. What's the emperor reverse nine of cups? Pisces, Jupiter. And seven of swords in reverse. Yeah, somebody like throwing a rock and hiding their hand. That's crazy. For some of you guys, somebody consciousness is kicking in. Yours or this emperor reverse could be a, a divine masculine that is having paternity issues, one or the other. But I feel like that's a karmic masculine right here, to be honest. Aquarius moon with the seven of swords in reverse. Yeah, whoever this is, they, they, they really had enjoyment here being a two-faced losing punk asshole. This person is just, I, I don't... Anyways, some souls reverse. <laughs> What's the fuck is the seven of souls reverse? Somebody here getting caught in some shit, caught in a lie. What's the seven of souls reverse? Somebody here. Something could have came out while somebody was having sex. Like maybe somebody slipped up and said some shit while they was having sex with another person, which revealed a secret. Or, oh. Somebody here could be homosexual. I mean, obviously, that's been coming out a lot about this damn man. Somebody here is having sex with other men and they keep on trying to hide it or something, too. Um, Because the Nine of Cups is homosexuality. The Emperor Reverse, the Nine of Cups is... Mm. But somebody could have slipped up and said something while they was having sex or something like that. And it revealed, like, somebody... I don't know what they slipped up and said... But what's the seven of swords in the reverse? <laughs> what the fuck? Why they was having sex with this dark high priestess or a dark witch or something like that? What the fuck is the seven of swords in the reverse, y'all? Six of wands? Yeah, what's it? Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. Somebody here stealing credit for your work as well. Mm-hmm. Stealing credit for your work. What's the seven of swords in the reverse? Six of wands. Something also is being revealed to a crowd of people. This, um... <clears throat> Something is being, uh, either somebody is confessing something to a crowd of people or somebody here just can't get away with some shit. I feel like it's too many people here that support you too. If somebody's trying to do something behind your back, you have too many people that fuck with you. So what's the seven of souls reverse, six of wands? I feel like somebody could also be, yeah, the temperance reverse. They're trying to get people that do support you to turn their back on you. Is what I'm getting. That's the, that's their way of trying to steal credit for your work. By just um, trying to steal your uh, recognition, whatever you're doing in the public eye with the Nine of Cups. Yeah, this person thinks they're going to try to control some shit, control your fame, your fortune. Something here that you're meant to be doing. By getting a bunch of dark witches to attack your ass. Because some of y'all could be spiritually. So, of course, they're like, oh, okay, well, let me go find the, the darkest witch to try to hurt this person with their fucking pussy ass. Somebody's a loser. <laughs> like this person. I have, I'm just so, like, I can't believe people sit up here and do this shit, man, to other people. It's ridiculous. Tempers reverse. Sagittarius. So discord. Yeah, discord, disharmony, or somebody doing something in haste. Like, they, they stupid. It's just so they can be seen as somebody. But they don't want to tell about the fact that they down low, though. They don't want, they don't want to say that. They don't want to be authentic about that with their stupid, ratchet, down low ass. I was going to say something else, but I respect gay people. I like gay people. I like every damn body. God is love. I don't give a fuck what you are. I feel like, honestly, if you're spiritual, being homophobic here is just not in your in the cards. or That's something that you shouldn't be because I feel like, I don't know, like, if you believe in God anyway, I feel like you shouldn't be homophobic. But that's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got one, so you can ignore it. You can say fuck it or they saying, or she's saying something dumb or whatever. But I just feel like if you believe in God or if you 
you shouldn't i feel like spirit don't care about what somebody is i really feel like that i feel like spirit don't give a fuck about what somebody is as long as you're loving and as long as you know how to love and love others it just shouldn't matter what the fuck you are I really don't feel like that. I feel like live your life how the fuck you want to live it. I feel like spirit, what people don't understand about spirit is that spirit has a sense of humor. Like spirit is really down to earth. Spirit is cool, calm, and collected as long as you're doing whatever the fuck they ask. As long as you're being obedient and following your purpose here. Spirit just wants you to be happy at the end of the day. So whatever's not making you happy, if you're not happy being uh, straight, then you're going to be something else, right? Bisexual, homo, whatever. But I just can't stand a down low ass, pussy ass nigga like this. That don't want to, you know what I'm saying, be real about who they are. But they want to use your energy to hide what they what they are. Or use your energy to hide from their karma. That's some pussy ass shit. I don't respect it. Period. I don't respect that shit at all. What the fuck is the Knight of Cups reverse? Mm. <clears throat> Page of Cups reverse. Yeah, somebody here that, that is... is they're really hung up on their reputation. Like, this person only wants people to see them a certain way. They're real true selves. They don't want that to be shown. This person is a narcissist. So, of course, they know a lot of motherfuckers. Okay, they know people that know how to cover up for them and all kinds of shit. They even lie to these people that's covering up for them. They, these people don't know shit about this damn emperor reverse. They keep, they live a double life. They keep a lot of their shit that they do to themselves. But they show one way, they act one way around these people, one way with you. And I bet they just as nice as fuck, as, as nice as they want to be to your ass. Because they're a pussy-ass, clown-ass, cowardly-ass hoe. <laughs> like, they don't want to say, oh, well, yeah, I've been spiritually attacking you. I feel like you... They can't talk like an adult. Like, oh, I feel like you fucked me over. So that's why I got so-and-so to attack you. And I know... You know what I'm saying? Or not even I know it was wrong. I don't feel like... I don't see this person saying, I know that was wrong because they are just a fucking clown. They don't want to say that. They're just going to be like... Or I, I just picture them saying, like, at least... That, yeah, I got people to attack you because I was heartbroken. I feel like you you switched up on me. I feel like something like that. They can't be a real nigga and do that. This is a pussy-ass whore. They are. They give whore vibes. They are whore. But then they try to act like they, whoever this is, they try to act street. Or they, they want some street creds for hurting somebody. It's like, bitch, you don't get no respect from the Lord. You might get respect from these other losing bitches. But you ain't gonna get respect on this damn earth. You getting ready to experience hell on earth, bitch, for doing this shit to somebody that ain't did shit to you, but leave your narcissistic ass behind. So, do what you will, but just know, life ain't gonna be too cute after what the fuck you did. So, whether, you, I don't know, this person might not care about that either, because their life already shit, they ain't got shit to lose. So, anyways, but they care about that reputation, though. That's the one thing they trying to save, and bitch, that shit coming out, ain't it? I know that's why they're trying to attack the fuck out of my channel. I'll be seeing the views go up and down, back and forth. They're trying to attack the fuck out of my channel. they like, no, we can't have this secret coming out. Bitches coming out. The right people going to see it. The world going to get around some way, somehow. So it don't matter. So anyways, what's this? Nine of Cups reverse, Page of Cups in the reverse. For some of you, this person right here, they just need to really go heal. There could be some sort of child abuse or something here that happened to this person and they don't want to heal from it. They're not healing from it. I just feel like something has truly taken over this person. For some of you, this person's mama is what I just heard. Could have sold them to somebody, trigger warning, or they could have sacrificed their own damn child. They let whoever do whatever to their child while they went off and did whatever the fuck they went off and did. Somebody could be on drugs heavy, all kind of shit. Like, it's really sad that people endure that kind of pain but this shit is just unacceptable you're grown now it's time to heal from that shit bro as hard as it is you gonna have to do it because this shit is unacceptable your life is literally falling apart because of the shit that you're doing to other people that ain't did shit to you somebody here don't know how to take rejection <clears throat> listen out of cups reverse page of cups reverse somebody getting a lot of fucking bad news though i know that page of cups reverse matter cups reverse somebody intuition is blocked for sure their creativity is blocked Ten of Wands in the reverse. <clears throat> Somebody here could be sick. I mean, they are sick mentally. But somebody here could be sick for sure. Something too is, is like somebody beating a dead horse here. Something that just ain't working. This could be chronic fatigue though. Like somebody's tired. What's this Ten of Wands reverse? For some of you, somebody's getting bad news about a child. A child could be sick or something. What's the center of reverse? 
Queen of Wands in the reverse and the judgment. <clears throat> mm. I feel like honestly, all the people that this person used to attack you here, they they ass is sick. They sick here. Like, they, they falling off one by one. This little posse that they use to torment you, they falling off first for some of you. I feel like God got something special in store for this bitch over here, this king of wands. Because they definitely trying to be separate from these bitches. Or this, they follow these hoes. That's why they get knocked off first or something like that. I don't fucking know. But the queen of wands reversing the judgment here. Something, I feel like you're being vindicated from something. You're being free from something here because you're being seen as innocent in the situation. Like this, this can't, yeah, this not a cups reverse, but the page of cups and the reverse is the one being seen as guilty in something. You're being vindicated with the judgment upright because I feel like these bullies, I mean, I don't know. I don't respect their ass after all the shit that they did. They thought that shit was cute and funny with their old tired ass. They old as fuck. 35, 45 year old bitches. 25 is too damn old. 20 is too damn old to be sitting up here doing this shit. But I'm just saying, this Queen of Wands reverse here, or somebody's awakening to the fact that this Queen of Wands, oh yeah, somebody, for some of you, um, your Divine Masculine could be awakening, uh, okay, I'm getting a lot of stories. Your Divine Masculine could be awakening to the fact that this Queen of Wands in the reverse has been bullying you. So you're being seen as the victor in the situation. Somebody sees you as innocent and they see this person as guilty. Okay, and I feel like this this divine masculine could not be confronting this person. They're not saying shit to this bitch. They're just moving on with their life, rightfully so. Like, I'm going to just move on because I know this bitch is a losing hoe. They're going to try to get me locked up in some more shit. So let me just move on. I'm not even going to get no bitches to beat this hoe ass, even though I want to. <laughs> I'm not going to get nobody to beat this hoe ass. I'm going to just move on my life. So good. Um, And so somebody's dropping this bird in Ten of Wands reverse, which is, which is also bad. This is bad news for this, this, this down low ass motherfucker. They, this is bad news for them. Somebody here, they work together. This Queen of Wands reverse with this Page of Cups reverse, Knight of Cups reverse. They working with this Queen of Wands in the fucking reverse. And reporting back to these hoes. To, you know what I'm saying? They report back to each other. <laughs> but, you know, this is separate stories. I feel like this Divine Masculine could be seeing that this person is a hoe. Okay? And like I said, they could be having fraternity issues with this Queen of Wands reverse because they're a hoe. They're a cheater. And this person is finally awakening to the fact that they're a dark witch. They're a hoe. They're a liar. And... A child ain't theirs and they also been trying to bully you the love of their damn life they're ten of cups they've been trying to bully you yeah the judgment so they're like yeah hell no nah. let me get the fuck away from this greasy asshole because they ain't shit yeah so yeah this shit is just clearing out for you Taurus. <laughs> like I, I just i cannot hear what's the seven of wands reverse you guys be seeing seven 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 nine 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 seven of wands reverse but this is bad news for this karmic masculine pseudo because um their whole goal as well just like this queen wands in the reverse their whole goal was to keep you and somebody apart and to stop your money from flowing stop you from being in your your calling so now that that's not working everybody everybody should just falling apart yeah the seven of cups reverse and the and the king of cups strong, strong scorpio here someone could have a scorpio venus definitely seven 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 <clears throat> But yeah, this seven of cups reverse is, is an illusion that's being broken here. Somebody's realizing that they missed an opportunity here. We're trying to like stop this shit from occurring between you and your person or stop this person's gifts from um, stop them from from being able to see their gifts or understand that they are gifted. They are a divine masculine or something like that. For some of you, this could be a spirit guide here. Yeah, that's, that's bringing down this damn. Yeah, the ten of swords reverse, justice reverse. For some of you, this king of cups could be a spirit guide. That is bringing on this some mess here. Seven of Cups in reverse is a root of awakening for somebody. <clears throat> What's this Seven of Cups in the reverse? But, okay, you have a Queen of Swords. Mm. Yeah, so somebody's awakening and saying that you're telling the truth about something here, Queen of Swords, Taurus. That's you. <laughs> you be a Taurus Gemini Cusper. What's the Seven of Cups reverse, Queen of Swords? <clears throat> Yep, the devil. Yeah, who I got this for? I think the last reading I did was Cancer. You could see, or was it Cancer or was it Sagittarius? I mean, it was Cancer, I think. I don't know. Go, yeah, go watch Cancer. <laughs> okay, Capricorn energy. Yeah, you, somebody, so somebody is realizing that you're the real high priestess or, or you're the one that sees, you're the one that's able to help them see 
how to move forward in their life in a 3D because spiritually you could see that something was attacking to your person. <clears throat> so a hex or something here, a curse has been broken because somebody can see clear. Somebody's awakening and it's happening to their gifts and things like that. But you could see that the dark attachment that somebody has on them. Okay. Yeah, somebody see somebody's able to like trust you a little bit more than they they uh than they was at first. They probably didn't. Obviously, because they were sleeping. They thought this this bitch right here was the one for their ass, and they're not. What the fuck is the King of Cups? Or. Okay, yeah. The Page of Pentacles reverse. Yeah. And the Eight of Cups reverse. And the Five of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, so I feel like what you're explaining to this person is or what you're saying to this person is how dark magic is affecting them and their emotional state and their heart chakra. Um, Eight of Cups Reverse is somebody that is non-committal. This is somebody that has a lot of insecurities, abandonment wounds, abandonment issues. So I feel like what you did was help somebody awaken by showing them what they needed to heal in order for this black ass magic to stop working. I feel like you taught this person too about monitoring spirits. You taught this person a lot of shit. Or you are currently. Yeah, something here. So how somebody is faking their happiness. And they're stagnant. But it's because of the magic. You can sense it. You see it. Yeah. <clears throat> mm-hmm. And this King of Wands, if they paid these high priestess hoes or work with, with your fucking divine masculine's ex and these bitches at this... Because this masculine, these narcissists, they know a lot of people, bro. They will go digging. They are experts at digging and finding shit. Finding people that you deal with or deal or dealt with or whatever to work against you. Like, these are th these kind of people. They covert narcissists. They spiritual narcissists. They malignant narcissists. They will find every damn body that you deal with so they can, like, so that way they won't be able to support you. Like, dead ass. That's, that's what I'm getting with this reading. Like, they all are working in cahoots. They're all in the same fucking group. But it could be different. Flip the damn rose. I don't know. I feel like some of y'all don't even know that. But I'm just saying, bro. A lot of shit I feel like spirit has hidden because if you knew about a lot of shit, things wouldn't have gone the way that they're going right now. Spirit wants your, your end of things and your side of things to keep you. They want you to keep moving forward and keep peace. Like, they don't want your shit to be fucked up because they know if you found out about certain things that these people were doing, then it would just be different. You know, so yeah, the five of cups in the reverse is healing. So yeah, you've taught somebody, you're showing somebody that they need to heal. <clears throat> For some of you, I just heard too, that you passed some sort of test as well. There could be somebody that was trying to come in, into your life at some point in your journey that you knew was not the one for you. <clears throat> And you pass the test because you recognize some sort of demon, some sort of pattern here that could have been repeated if you would have went into it. Okay, this could be a totally different person. It's not your masculine. Yeah, they don't align with your mouth. Yeah, I say your mouth. <laughs> they don't align with your morals and your values. So you moved on. Six of swords, you were being guided to move on. I feel like that really completed the healing phase for you to come into union with yourself. You recognizing something here in somebody that could have been hard to read, but this is a test for your discernment. You recognizing something within somebody <clears throat> was the last test for you to pass, Taurus, and I feel like you passed that shit with flying colors, honey. Some sort of plan or strategy is not working here with them trying to fuck up your relationships or get you to go down the wrong path with your damn relationships. So what's this two of cups reverse? Okay, you got a four of wands. What's two of cups reverse, four of wands? <clears throat> Yeah, you passed the test. Yeah, this is like a goal being achieved here with the four of wands. A celebration here. You could be on a twin flame journey. And now you're in union with yourself or you're getting ready to be in union with your twin. But you have to be in union with yourself first. So this could be a new contract coming in for, for some of you. Someone could have Aries Venus. What's the two of cups reverse? Four of wands. Yeah, the hermit. Yeah, shadow work. Doing a lot of shadow work here. <clears throat> Going within. Somebody here could be looking for a new home. Okay. But somebody doing their shadow work here is bringing them into union with themselves. Which is also 
cutting a cord with a connection here that was abusive, toxic, they, they're not compatible, you're not compatible with this person. Like somebody doing their shadow work really is just <laughs> helping a union become more stronger. So I feel like you and your masculine, if y'all both doing that shit, that's what's bringing this union together. But for some of you, Taurus, if this is just you fighting, but for some of you guys, I feel like you fought by yourself the whole time for, for, uh, for some of you. I mean, it could feel like that, but your person has been fighting too, but if they've been spiritually attacked and you're the only one that can see spiritually you've been attacked by your karmic ex their karmic ex this group a whole group of slew of dark witches warlocks and just all kind of shit here demons entities like all kind of demonic shit i feel like you are so powerful like your discernment the whole time has brought you out of some sort of dark energy if you didn't have discernment bro you would be fucked up right now you really would What's this hermit right here, spirit? Virgo energy. Six of cups reverse. Yeah, somebody doing their shadow work is really um, cutting the cord to the past. Somebody is growing or maturing. They leaving a the nest here. Somebody is awakening to a twin flame connection too. Yeah, this person is awakening to a twin flame connection. <clears throat> Learning more about it, doing their research, analyzing. What's the, or this hermit here is watching there could be somebody here that is um, spying or watching a connection come together or watching you be celebrated or watching you celebrate, be victorious. What's the hermit here with the six of cups reverse? Because this could also be alternatively somebody that won't release the past. But um, I feel like if this is you, Taurus, <clears throat> this could be you growing uh, emotionally too. You've grown emotionally as well but i feel like somebody's learning more about you really they're researching they're analyzing they're studying more about connections soulmate connections twin flame connections they're studying could be possibly magic for some of you like somebody here is understanding the dark side of things versus the light this queen of cups here they're understanding that you can see the demons attached to them you could see that they're being hexed cursed they they got spill work attached to them you could see it and they they see now that you can see it and this is where this person is, is realizing that you can help them. You They need you. You need them. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <clears throat> For some of you guys, if you were scared about your... um Something about you not being able to have kids and things like that. You could have been going to the doctor to see, like, what's wrong with you. There's, you're fine. I feel like you're not infertile at all. I feel like this is a spiritual... um A hex, a curse that somebody has been doing to you to block your fertility. There ain't shit wrong with you. You had to get rid of this cord that attached you to this demonic entity. Whatever the fuck this is. He had a Ten of Swords reverse. Ace of Wands reverse. He had a High Priestess reverse. This was definitely like an attack on your your um sacral energy. You could definitely have kids. It's just got to be with this person. And I feel like it's very your journey is very specific. That's why I feel like it's a twin. You're only supposed to have kids with somebody else. Or some of y'all already have kids through a this karmic person. But your next child, your second child, your third child, whatever, is supposed to be with a divine masculine, divine feminine. And the only way that y'all can have that is if you break this karmic cycle with these demonic attachments that's blocking your fertility. What's the four of wands? Because some of y'all could, could be a mother already. But the six of cups in the reverse could talk about um, having a problem conceiving. And the hermit is a doctor. I feel like this, this hermit is somebody that's been spying on you. <clears throat> They've been using your sacral chakra, which is your fertility, to spy. They've been spying through that way. And I feel like it's because you um, connected to this person, obviously, sexually in the past, and you never got rid of this entity. It's a dark spirit attached to you here that this person got. There's incubus, succubus. What's the four of wands? Yeah, the page of wands, I'm telling you. Yeah, there's a child. Or oh, this could be like good news. Good news here, a celebration for you, uh, Taurus. Some of you guys have good news here. You, you could have just gotten a home. Okay, congrats, <laughs> Taurus. Um, or there could be something going on with your child. There could be a celebration here happening with the child. This could be graduation. Okay, so congrats to your children. Okay, but I just feel like somebody sees all the positive shit flowing towards you. You could be in communication or getting ready to, to get some sort of communication from your twin. Or this could be travel plans here that's being made. But I just feel like this you're on the up and up. 
Like, what the fuck? Yeah, and whatever you're, you're doing is protected. What's the Four of Wands, Page of Wands? Okay, Two of Wands reversed. <clears throat> Aries, Mars here. Yeah, so, yeah, somebody is seeing that the grass is greener on your, your end. So this person is doing a shadow work. I feel like that's your person. Yeah, four four swords in the damn ten of cups. Yeah, that's your person. This person, yeah, king of cups to the queen of cups. Yeah, so this is your person here opening their heart to you. Five of pentacles reverse is their money. This person is going to see evidence that they made the right decision by choosing this path <clears throat> by going through this awakening here because if they didn't, they were still going to be attacked by this dark witch, which, which was going to have them stuck. But I feel like, obviously, on a soul level, if you have a twin, you know that this person did not mean to do whatever. Like, if they if they went backwards, it's because they were hexed. Somebody here was hexed, and they didn't understand how to do their shadow work. Now that they've met you or understand something here, they're doing their shadow work. And somebody's getting ready to see a replenishment with their money, their health, their finances, all kind of shit. It's getting ready to get better. And this damn King of Swords, how from reverse, this dark-ass... Because Taurus, I feel like for some of you guys, Divine Feminine, this King of Souls reverse, higher from reverse, is this fucking dark uh, high priest. Your, um, your karmic, ma your karmic masculine. Yeah, that, that wants to control and dictate somebody here. They act being blocked out of your energy. And so is this dark witch here, this high priestess. Yeah, so this is you and your person breaking free of a dark, dark people. So you can move on. What's the moon reverse? Yeah, the Eight of Swords. What's the Moon Reverse? Eight of Swords. Three of Wands Reverse. Aries, Sun, Gemini, Jupiter with the Eight of Swords. Mm. <clears throat> so, yeah, I feel like somebody is spiritually blind at this time. Somebody's intuition blocked. This Moon Reverse, and somebody's intuition is completely blocked. Okay. Um... Somebody, this is like self-deception. Somebody's delusional. This magic here is just catching up to somebody, really, is what I'm getting. I'm also getting somebody here that ain't got no sense of foresight. They can't see into something because this karmic attachment, this uh, soul tie is gone. So however they were monitoring you and able to tell if you were messing with someone else or dealing with somebody else, they're not able to see that no more. Eight of Swords is somebody here in fear. They're scared. <clears throat> and you're moving away from fear and anxiety. The moon reverse. But it's like, um, yeah, something being revealed to you as well. But somebody ain't got no, they ain't got no foresight. They don't know how to move forward with their future. They ain't got no gifts. They don't know how to use magic no more to get where they need to be at. What they lose their ass. That's what they get. That's exactly what the fuck they get. Three of Wands reverse. It's a lack of growth and expansion. Restricted options. Like, what's the Eight of Swords? Six of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody need help financially. <clears throat> somebody need help financially. Towards Moon. Yeah, but somebody's scared that they're gonna be there's gonna be equal give and take between you and your person. And it is, yeah, five of wands. Somebody could be eating some Peruvian chicken. Or you could be going to a Peruvian place to get food or something like that, Taurus. I love, I love Peru chicken. <laughs> I do. With that white rice and that yellow sauce. Oh, Damn, Taurus. Now I'm about to go get some. And I'm supposed to be cooking. <laughs> I want to cook, okay? Because... Anyways, what's the Eight of Swords with the Six of Pentacles? Oh, Five of Swords. Hmm. Yeah, somebody's trying to bind somebody. Somebody is, is that, that's the secret that's coming out. Somebody's understanding now more about spirituality and how the fuck they, they could easily be attacked if they don't get their shit together. <laughs> like, just period. But this Five of Swords here. Somebody here is just flipping out. Like, they are so mad. This karmic right now is could be attacking you and how you make your money, okay? Somebody, five of swords is here. <clears throat> so somebody is trying to be funny. 
or trying to win at all costs and shit like that. Somebody could be trying to bind or they're trying to um block something for you, Tori. This could be like your money or something like that. They mad as fuck. Like they're bad. They're trying to attack you or attack something that you're doing. I feel like they're trying to stop your money flow because you could be actually helping your person in some sort of way. And they're trying to stop you from being able to help this person. So they're like, well, in order for me to stop them from helping this person, I got to fuck with their finances too, bitch. That's the wrong, that's definitely the wrong route. You need to sit your ass down somewhere with your funk. Go take a bath. <laughs> Go take a bath. <laughs> Go do something. Because, bitch, this is the wrong thing to be sitting up here doing. Real shit. Somebody here trying to make someone self-sabotage or make someone feel like, oh, they're they not they're not going to receive the help that they need or they're not going to do this and do that. I feel like this person, the moon in reverse, is somebody here is moving away from anxiety and fear. They're the ones that tr that's trying to, that's projecting this shit onto this person. Like this person trying to convince your person, this karmic feminine is trying to convince your divine masculine that they don't have help or they don't have support. That's not true. Losing asshole bitches, you done ain't got the support because your support is gone. Uh, the support that you wanted from this damn divine masculine bitch they gone you the one that's <clears throat> that's scared that your support won't be gone and it, it is this the day this is the day this is the day this is the day that the lord has made that the lord has made i will rejoice I will rejoice and be glad. Ain't that how I go? Be glad. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and dun 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 dun. Oh, this is the day. <laughs> this is the day that the Lord has made. <laughs> Duh, that's an old ass gospel song, child. I remember when I was going to church, I used to hear that song a lot. They used to have me sing that song solo in the morning, child, in the choir. I'm like, that. why the fuck y'all with me? But anyways, <laughs> so let's see. What's the three of wands reverse? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Yep, it, it's a cuss. Yeah, they don't see this big love coming for you, Taurus. They ain't seeing that. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Somebody here is trying to stop your growth, Taurus. Just, just protect yourself, child. That's all I'm going to say. Something here is returning to somebody, too. The love and the joy that they have with you is returning to this person. Somebody's going through an awakening. <clears throat> and they're realizing that they've been in love with you on a soul level, this person. This King of Cups over here. Yeah, like something is something is returning back to somebody's consciousness. Like they're remembering things from past lives. Let me see. Let me get a few of these before. Or okay, I wanted to. Okay, I'm gonna put this back. I wasn't ready. I want. I want to see this. What's this down here? <coughs> Tree. Karmic connection, yeah, past life. I told you this person is remembering things from past lives, bro. Yeah, angel and message. I can't make that shit up, bro. This person, yeah, child. Yeah, that's new beginning. Fresh start, new beginning, or phase, newness. Yeah, this person is opening up like they're realizing something about past lives with you and them. It said karmic connection, past life, deja vu, spiritual beliefs and health, spiritual strength, constant changes, your spiritual or need to be spiritual in nature's energy. Exactly. I don't know what the fuck I'll be talking about. Yeah, wedding. This person is remembering that y'all were y'all were married in a past life or something like that. Yeah, gift and friend. This person is remembering that you was a gift to them. You and this person could just be friends now. Y'all started off as friends. Oh, that's so cute, Taurus. What else? <laughs> yeah, mother. Yeah, something about a child. Feminine, nurturing, compassion. Oh, that's like the Empress, Taurus, Libra energy. Feminine, nurturing, compassion, understanding, someone to lean on, looking for comfort, caress, mother's touch, mommy issues, motherly support, and pregnant. Yeah, this person. <clears throat> yeah, journey. That's my twin flame journey card. Oh, what's mother? <laughs> yeah, house. 
Real estate, security, stability, roots, family, home, possession, safety, neighborhood, strong and steady. Who's mother with house? And past life. Yeah, this person. Damn, Taurus. Say past events, people from the past, past life connection, history, memories, familiar, familiarity, and old soul. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yep. What's this right here? Jealousy, uh, fear of losing something or someone to someone else, poor self-esteem, fear of the other woman, <laughs> obstacle in the connection, feeling threatened, social comparison, spiteful and resentful. Yeah, this is what you could see. Yeah, a two-year twin flame, the journey card came out, child. It's a travel, exploring places or options, taking off, moving on, letting go, vacation time, childhood, profit, self-discovered progress, <clears throat> welcoming harmonious change, twin flame journey full of self-love, coming and going, yeah. Yeah, you know, this is this jealous so trying to get your person to be in and out or to make you feel like, oh, that's not the person because they're in and out. I feel like you had to learn a lot because I got confused on my journey a lot. Y'all see me on here confused as fuck a lot about my twin friend journey. Like, bitch, if they, I, I had it made up in my mind. If they have twin friend, they ain't going to ghost you. <laughs> like, they definitely will. Okay, if they ain't awake and they going to be back and forth for a minute. <clears throat> but you are too, though. But it doesn't look like it because you're more so focused on your twin, which is the problem. Okay, I've noticed that too. Like when I was, because I, shit, I'm past the runner chaser phase. <laughs> that phase is done with, so you know what that means. <laughs> but anyway, it's like when I, like I've noticed that when they're running, I'm chasing. When I'm running, they're chasing. Like what the fuck? Something here is balanced out now. Well, for some of us, not for everybody. But we have certainty here. Yeah, everything stays the same, solid and accountability, a fixed situation, reliable and truthful, positivity with firmness. <clears throat> yeah, somebody here is jealous of this damn twin flame connection. And it's just like, okay, what's this up here with this mess with this hoe? Cheerfulness. <clears throat> Something in my throat. <laughs> A joyous social event, receptiveness, celebrations, invitation. Hanging out with friends, having fun, letting loose and being happy, having a good time, letting go of negativity, period. Widower. Mm. Mourning the past, a situation must be accepted. Isolation and feeling abandoned. Mature woman, wise, older, influential woman. A mother figure, good advisor, boss, mentor, teacher, ex, or the other woman. With the quotes beside her. Yeah, because somebody here, I feel like this bitch here wanted to make it seem like, oh, you were intruding or you're a homewrecker. Bitch, I'm the one that's supposed to be here. You're the homewrecker. You need to get the fuck. And that's what, exactly what it's looking like. It's happening. <laughs> like, bitch, motherfuckers like to flip, a, flip the script and make you look bad. Bitch, you know, you the one that's supposed to have been left with your hexing and black magic using ass. You the one supposed to leave and you are. Bye. So we have thought, <clears throat> escaping mentally, planning ahead, overthinking, overanalyzing, indecision, contemplation, meditate on your concerns, daydreaming and thinking things through. Yeah, somebody here <clears throat> could be um in their, their mind, they're thinking now and as they're meditating or whatever, they're having past life thoughts or dreams or something like that. What's thought here? Or well, this could be just a bit stressed out thinking. Okay, main female. Mm, yeah, the current is female, an important female in the reading, wife, partner, or girlfriend. What's thought here with main female? Oh, uh, okay. Hmm. Ghost. <laughs> okay, yeah, because I was thinking, whoever this is, somebody here getting a reading done to see what's going on with the connection. They're, they're going through a tower because somebody is finding out that this mature woman is getting ready to be with this damn man, this, this, this divine masculine. They keep getting readings done on you, divine feminine, this person. <clears throat> yeah, because this man has ghosted their ass. They left. They gone. Like, what the fuck? What's the mature woman? <laughs> Cheat. Yeah, in the reverse. Yeah, because you ain't no damn cheater. Yeah, divine support and hex. Yeah, you're helping this person break free of this fucking hex here. Yeah, main male, young, soulmate. Yeah, half truths. Yeah, you're helping this person break free of this damn hex and this curse. This bitch keep going. That's why I stopped doing personals. We got bitches like that coming and try to see who's do, who's doing what and who's who. Bitch, you ain't getting my time and energy. I just stopped doing them, period. I give too much details in my readings to even need personal readings. You get a whole fucking... You get all the answers you need in my shit. <laughs> like I'm, I'm not doing no damn personals. So, but let's see. What's... Okay, you got a devil. 
Oh, it's good over. <clears throat> Sudden wealth. Big financial winning. I mean, big financial gain, winnings, monetary gift, financial success, inheritance, inner and outer wealth. <clears throat> Angel. Protection, intuition, ancestors, synchronizations, guides watching over you. Yeah, prayers being heard. Manifestation on his way, awakenings and realizations. Yeah, an ancestor, child. We got angels and ancestors right here. Widower. Somebody here passed away. For some of you, somebody here passed away and was left an inheritance. This is man. Or this is you. <clears throat> somebody could be mourning a mother figure. Somebody here, yeah. Or, yeah, I'm getting... Somebody here left this person an inheritance. It's an ancestor. Somebody here passed away, a guardian angel or some shit like that. Somebody could have passed away in some sort of war, in a war, fighting for this, this cricket-ass country. <clears throat> so for some of you, you remind this person of their mother. This masculine, you remind this person of their mother. Mm. This person here loved their mama. Somebody's mom could have passed away. My condolences. <clears throat> for some of you for some of you your enemy here is sick they asked to send up here sick for some of you this enemy this karmic ex of this damn masculine's here could have taken <clears throat> could have hurt somebody in this masculine's family here through magic Somebody here, that's crazy as fuck. And they ask, that's why they ask getting ready to be sick right now. They, However they hurt somebody in this masculine's family, they gonna, this is going to be the same way they get their ass taken out. If that's the case. If somebody here passed away and you don't really know how they pass it, just all of a sudden, I feel like, yeah. All right. They say something from the past to incorporate into your life. Fear of aging, breaking generational curses. Yeah, wise decisions, running out of time. <clears throat> Somebody could be getting messages now from they, whoever has passed away in their life. They're getting messages and synchronizations from this ancestor. And that somebody's opening up to understanding something about guardian angels and things like that. Clarity. It says, clarity is my birthright. Change me, divine beloved, into one who remembers in every moment my true self, love, light, wisdom, and divinity, period. Somebody understanding who the fuck they are and the fact that they're actually divine masculine and divine feminine. Generosity, yeah. I am, a, I am abundant love. Change me, divine beloved, into one who can easily send blessings to all, even those filled with negativity or fear. May I shower the planet with love, knowing there is an unlimited ocean within me. <clears throat> beauty i am a spark of divinity change me divine beloved into one who knows without question my own beauty worthiness and desirability let me remember constantly who i am love itself in a temporary human form somebody here really sees the beauty in you they see your divinity they see how generous uh, generous you've been to them this person is finally getting clarity that you've been nothing but a good person to them and this fucking hex and this curse has been blinding their ass to who the fuck you are and what they what the importance of this connection is. Like dead ass. What else? <clears throat> trust. I am I mean, I trust the highest way. Change me, divine beloved, into one who wants what you want for me. Let me trust that my needs will always be met in the highest way when I allow you to guide me. Yeah, this person is opening up. This is over this King of Cups down here. This person is finally opening up and they're trusting. They're learning how to trust this connection. Which is going to lead them to victory and success, child. Y'all getting ready to have kids, have a family, all kind of shit. It said, desires, I offer all longings to you. Change me, divine beloved, into one who offers all longings to you. Let me feel whole, knowing all true needs will be handled. You are my source for all. Mm -hmm, this person, yeah. Then we have divine assistance. I am open to receive. Exactly. This bitch want to try to make it seem like you ain't got no help, bitch. You, you got help. Plenty of it, divine masculine. Cause they definitely trying to fuck with this person's head and abuse this person to make them feel like they ain't got nobody. And I feel like that for some of you, if this person's mother passed away, they trying to use this person's that that person's death to hurt this person even worse. That's why this bitch getting ready to be falling. They they shit getting ready to fall the fuck down. 
Like, for real. I can't stand this stupid hoe. And they nasty ass ways. This person, they need to get the fuck on somewhere. But it say divine assistance. I am open to receive. Change me, divine beloved, into one who is willing to receive all the right help. Let me feel deserving of divine assistance in every way. Open me to receive. And they are. They are the ancestors, the angels is guiding them right now as we speak. <clears throat> so, very beautiful reading for us. Okay. I hope that this, um, <clears throat> I gotta clear my throat, y'all. I hope that this reading resonated for you. Okay. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you won't miss my reads. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.